After 29 years and more than 6,000 shows, here we are. Phil Donahue changed the face of daytime television forever with a talk show that tackled controversial issues in front of a live audience. We were so different. Everything else around us was a soap opera, a game show. Donahue honed his broadcasting skills early in his career as a radio and TV news anchor in his native Ohio. His big break came in 1967 when Dayton's WLWD-TV launched The Phil Donahue Show. Donahue had the groundbreaking idea of asking the studio audience for questions. Suddenly, people were watching people just like themselves stand up, kick tires, complain. And we found that we liked that. The Phil Donahue Show built a reputation as a forum for hot button topics like equal rights for women. Issues that women cared about and talked about among themselves, we were on the air talking about. I realized that people in the audience were asking better questions than I was. The show moved to Chicago and later New York, all the while expanding to more stations across America. National syndication meant higher profile guests, among them his future wife, actress Marlo Thomas. In 1977, audiences watched the couple fall in love live on stage. You are really fascinating. And no, you but are. you are wonderful. I said it when we were off the air, and I want to say you are loving and generous, and you like women, and it's a pleasure. And whoever is the woman in your life is very lucky. Well, thank yeah. you very much. <laughs> she was just uh, obviously a very exciting uh, person. She was not only gorgeous, she had great facility, language, and she had opinions, and she was a feminist. She was somebody you could argue with. Donahue paved the way for daytime talk show hosts like Geraldo Rivera, Jerry Springer, and Oprah Winfrey. But soon began losing viewers to his new lineup. In 1996, after years of declining ratings, the Phil Donahue show ended. Well, thank you. I am flattered. You may be seated. <laughs> Donahue returned in 2002 with a short-lived interview program on MSNBC. The left-leaning broadcaster claimed his outspoken opposition to the Iraq war led to the show's cancellation. In later years, he appeared as a political commentator and produced the 2007 anti-war documentary, Body of War. Let your voice be heard. Phil Donahue, daytime talk pioneer and an enthusiastic examiner of society's thorniest questions. I think everybody ought to have a talk show. It's a wonderful education.